What's up, people? So I'm at Zen Strength in Chiang Mai. This is Jason, and uh, we just did a breath work session, a little bit of Wim Hof, a little bit of holotropic breathing to just to prepare ourselves and calm ourselves down uh, to prepare for this bad boy right there. So we're gonna do a little ice bath, uh, dip ourselves fully in, and I've never done that before, so I'm excited to experience the benefits. More ice though. Okay, let's get a taster. Okay, 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 I feel it, I feel it. Yeah, so people ask, what are the benefits of, we just did breath work. So the benefits of breath work, you know, a lot of it is reducing stress. And it's, for me, it's like a superpower. So I can calm my body, I can energize my body. And for Wim Hof, what we're doing now is exposing my body to quite a bit of stress, with the cold and the ice bath. And so the breath work prepares us for that. And then we get in the ice bath and we get the benefits of the ice bath of reducing inflammation, burning fat, and increasing immunity and boosting testosterone. We'll stay in here. You know, a lot of people ask, how long do you need to stay in? Um, it depends. For the, the Wim Hof kind of just like prove that you can withstand the shock. A lot of people stay in for just like 90 seconds. And then we have people here, we don't have it quite as cold. It's like, it's like just under 10 degrees Celsius. Uh, which I think is like 40 degrees Fahrenheit. People usually stay in about 10 minutes here. And then uh, can you talk about the rod? What is that? Yeah, like? yeah. So we, so I have a, a few biohacks here. So this is uh, just a, a copper wire that's grounded to the earth. And so that gives us the benefit of when I'm holding this, um, my static electricity is discharging to the earth and I'm getting the benefits that a lot of people have talked about in terms of earthing or grounding. And then psychologically, I can think that I'm grounded and that will help too. So the other biohacks, uh, we have magnesium chloride in the water. Um, so that's the most absorbable form of magnesium that we're all deficient in, which is important for, they say, like two to 400 of body, our bodily functions. And uh, the biohack I add to that is with the, the sound and the music. So we're doing isochronic tones. Um, which is a way to entrain the brain. So we switch back and forth between energizing and calming tones. So just to kind of boost the, the benefits there. And my lower half is quite numb, but as I go in deeper, it's cold. Yeah. Now I can feel the pain of the cold again. So with that being said, it was my turn. As you can see my face, I was not prepared for it. But, you know, a couple stretches stalling, but I heard the noise and it's on. So I'm just following what Jason has said. Tell me to be calm, focus on long, deep exhale. So I take a nice deep breath. And as I go, I'm exhaling it out. Setting down into it as Jason suggested. Jason then passed me the rod, and it was honestly kind of helpful because it was a support. Something to hold on to, something to concentrate on, and I'm just exhaling. And slowly, slowly, I start accepting it, just really being with my body, being in the moment. And as you can see, I'm going deeper and deeper into it. Once you get deep, you feel relaxed, but the harder part is to go even deeper afterwards and I was able to do about 10 to 12 minutes in total.
take your time while you step there, man. That was cool, man. Yeah, man. You did it. Right. Yeah. You did it. <laughs> That was really cool. Just learn to completely relax and let go. And then in that actually I felt that I could, I'm actually very, very warm. I'm not cold, I wouldn't say I'm warm, but I could be there for a very, very long time, which is cool. The only challenge was to dip myself further into the ice bath, but once you're in with the relaxing kind of breath your body is able to tolerate it so it's 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 a cool thing that i've done this today kind of get out of my comfort zone and challenge myself to experience something that uh thought i never have the tolerance for so very very nice and the ice is almost melted so I'd say we're, without measuring, around 10 degrees Celsius.